Former Florida Governor Jeb Bush announces his bid for the 2016 Republican presidential nomination in Miami, Florida. Meanwhile, Hong Kong police display items found during a raid which led to the arrest of nine people and seizure of suspected explosives. Christine Domingo will tell us why. In America, former Florida Governor Jeb Bush is seeking to be seen as his own man and break out of a crowded field for the Republican presidential nomination to run in the November 2016 election. We will take command of our future once again in this country. We will lift our sights again, make opportunity common again, get events in the world moving our way again. We will take Washington, the static capital of this dynamic country, then turn it out of the business of causing problems and we'll get it back on the, on the right side of free enterprise and freedom for all Americans. I know we can fix this because I've done it. Bush 62 made his announcement at Miami-Dade College, a school whose multicultural student population was chosen to emphasize his commitment to trying to expand the appeal of the white-dominated Republican Party. Meanwhile, a Royal Dutch Shell drilling brig that will search for oil and gas in the Arctic pulled out of its temporary base in Seattle on Monday for the trip north to Alaska as dozens of activists in kayaks tried to stop its movement. Live television news reports show the rig being towed out of its terminal at the port of Seattle as kayakers formed a perimeter to try to prevent it from reaching shipping channels and heading out to the Puget Sound. The Coast Guard detained several protesters. In Hong Kong, Hong Kong police arrested nine people and seized suspected explosives as the city goes on high alert ahead of a crucial vote on a China-backed electoral reform package that sparked widespread protests last year. The overnight raids involving scores of officers came three days after police warned they were monitoring online activity to track anyone planning to incite violence. Police said the nine suspects were arrested on suspicion of conspiracy to manufacture explosives. During a news conference on Monday, police displayed a variety of items seized during the operation, including air guns, detonators for explosives, Guy Fox masks, and fake political leaflets. Superintendent of Police Organized Crime and Tried Bureau, Ao Chen Chao, said a suspect claimed links to a radical group but refused to identify it by name. Christine Domingo reporting for Y News.